the theme of this exhibition for us is bringing the Internet of Things to life. So for Panasonic that means showcasing our innovative devices and showing real applications of how that's used. We are showcasing Light ID technology. We develop the ability to modulate how LED is working. So LED is always blinking, so that it's emitting a unique code or ID that can be read by an ordinary smartphone using a Panasonic application. Through Light ID, uh, we can understand a customer journey, for example, through a museum, how they're using Light ID, how they're going through that museum and uh, engaging with the different artifacts that are on show, understanding the customer journey, and then provide that information to our customers so that they can better manage their museums. We just launched this wonderful device that's called a Tough Pad FZF1. It's not only a smartphone, it's also a handheld that has barcode reader capability, and it has a GPS, it's robust, you can drop it, it withstands rain or cold, heat. Therefore, Tough Pad is the perfect solution for our customers to work in any environment. The intelligent rear view monitor system has the intent to replace the interior mirror by a display with a camera in the back side of the vehicle, which is improving their safety for the driver because it's allowing to show in, the, in an image more field of view, able to detect a dead angle for the driver. One of the many things Ficosa is working on is V2X, which means connecting uh, cars to cars, connecting cars with buildings, with the street lights, or even motorways. V2X is the fourth pillar of autonomous driving, which is the future of mobility. Thanks to that, roads will be safer, transport costs and emissions will be reduced, and drivers will have uh, much more free time to enjoy the connected world. Internet of Things and autonomous driving are the present and the very short future, and Ficosa and Panasonic are key technological players of this new era. We manufacture the broadest range of devices in the world. So looking at the whole concept of the Internet of Things, we're looking at not only devices, but the connectivity through either machine to machine, IoT, but primarily to address real customer issues such as business risk and customer experience.